Hey YouTube, it's ICU and today I'm going to show you guys how to jailbreak iOS 5.1.1 on the iPhone 4, iPhone 3GS, iPod Touch 4th and 3rd generation, as well as the original iPad. Unfortunately, this does not work on the iPhone 4S, the iPad 2, or the new 3rd generation iPad, and this is a tethered jailbreak, which means that every time you have to reboot your iDevice, you will have to rerun a certain part of Red Snow, and I'll go over that in a second. Now, what you'll need for this tutorial is the latest version of Red Snow and your iOS 5.1 IPSW, not 5.1.1, and the reason for that is because Red Snow has not been updated yet to recognize the iOS 5.1 IPSW, so we'll have to trick it into thinking that we're jailbreaking 5.1, when in reality we're actually jailbreaking iOS 5.1.1. All right, so first I'm going to prove to you guys that my iPod Touch fourth generation here is on iOS 5.1.1 by going inside of Settings, General About, and down below here for the version, it does say iOS 5.1.1. Alright, now that I've got that out of the way, the first thing you'll need to do is open up Red Snow. And once Red Snow is open, immediately go to Extras and then select IPSW. Once you've checked that off, you will need to find your 5.1 IPSW and open it. Once it says Build Successfully Identified, you can click OK and then you can go back. And now we can plug in our iOS device. And now simply go to Jailbreak, and if iTunes opens up, just go ahead and quit out of it. In this instance, iTunes did open up, so again, I just quit out of it by right-clicking on it. Now, like I said, once your iDevice is plugged in, go to Jailbreak, and it will identify the data. All right, as you can see, it's identified my iPod Touch as the iPod Touch fourth generation on iOS 5.1, when in reality, again, we are on 5.1.1, but that's just because we're tricking Red Snow right now. And what you want to make sure you have checked is install Cydia. You can check any other options you want except install custom bundle. Now, this does vary depending on which device you have, but again, all we're really concerned about is install Cydia because you get Cydia when you jailbreak. Now, once you have install Cydia checked, you can click Next, and now it just tells you how to enter DFU mode. Now, we're going to go ahead and enter DFU mode ahead of time to actually bypass this screen. So it's extremely easy to do with your iOS device plugged in. Simply hold down the home and power button together for a total of 10 seconds. Once that 10 seconds is up, go ahead and let go of the power button and continue holding down on the home button. You're going to hold down on the home button for roughly 10 to 15 seconds. And once you've entered DFU mode, it should automatically bypass this screen and it should just go into the jailbreak process. All right, now another thing, I'm actually not going to cut anything out of this video. I'm just going to let it play through so you guys can see exactly how long each step takes. Now, while I'm waiting for this to finish up, you can go ahead and close out of Red Snow now. Once it says done, you know that's your cue to close out of Red Snow because we will have to open it back up in just a second. All right, now this step right here, moving applications, is actually the longest step. And once that's done, it should just breeze through the rest and it should boot back up.
All right, there we go. As you can see, now it bypassed that, and now it's going to installing bundles. And now it's in the process of rebooting. Okay, and now we're back up. And as you can see, we do have Cydia now. However, it is a white icon and it will not work when we try and open it. It just closes and Safari should also just close upon opening as well. So both of these things close on launch and that is because, again, this is a tethered jailbreak. It just boots up the first time because that's how it works. Now, what we have to do, and again, you will have to do this every time you reboot your iDevice, whether it's because it powers off or you just need to reboot it, you will have to plug it back into your computer and open up Red Snow. Again, we're going to need to go to Extras and then select IPSW. And once you have found your IPSW, go ahead and click Open. Again, this is the iOS 5.1 IPSW. Now, once it says it's successfully identified, you can click OK to that. And then we need to do the first option, Just Boot. So go ahead and click Just Boot and it will show you the same exact screen as before, just that you need to plug your iDevice in and then it will go through the steps to actually enter DFU mode with you. However, I'm going to do the method that I showed you guys previously, which is just holding down the home and power button together for a total of 10 seconds. Once that 10 seconds is up, go ahead and let go of the power button and continue holding the home button for about 10 to 15 seconds until it bypasses this screen. Now that it's bypassed the screen, we can let go, and it is simply exploiting our device, in this case the iPod Touch 4th generation with Lime Rain, and it will just boot back up into its tethered state. Again, here we go, it does say done inside of Red Snow, and you are safe to cancel out of it now if you want. Okay, here we go, we did boot back up, and now, as you'll notice, Cydia has its icon again, so now it is just the standard Cydia icon. We're just going to click user and done, and also Safari does work as well. All right, now for additional proof that I am on iOS 5.1.1, even though I did use the 5.1 IPSW, I'm just going to go inside of Cydia here and down below at the bottom, I'm going to scroll down and you will notice that again at the bottom, it does say that I am on an iPod Touch fourth generation on iOS 5.1.1 with Cydia 1.1.6. All right, so I hope you guys liked this video. If it helped you out and if it helped you jailbreak, please be sure to rate it up. Leave any comments down below in the comments section and just be sure to hit that subscribe button to be updated every time I release new videos. And until next time, this is ICU signing out.